Time for another, oh, I shouldn't clap like that. It is time for another coach life. I was sitting here meditating and just trying to, well not, uh, just trying to, I was listening to a YouTube video and it put me in a meditative state. As I thought, let me put together a coach life for red week three, third week of school, basically. So, here we go. Words have so much power that we completely miss the majority of it. If you think of an iceberg in the tip of the iceberg and the rest of it that's underneath the water as an analogy, um, it's way more powerful than that even. I was sitting here thinking about some of the words that we use which drain our power. Uh, and by power, I mean our ability to perceive reality and to convert it in a useful fashion or our ability to be our maximum powerful selves, you know, throughout the day. So I'll give you, I'll give you an example. Seven days in the week, right? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Uh, Saturday, Sunday. You call that a week. Something that's not strong. And shout out to Seven Bomar, actually. So a lot of this comes from listening to him and other linguists. But the linguist that really exposed me was Nam Chomsky and, uh, in my linguistics class at Emory. But anyways, something that's not strong, the opposite of strength is weakness. Something that's not strong, you call it weak. Seven days in a week, you think about the week as, you know, you hear it and you just think, okay, seven days or something that's not strong. You don't think seven days and you don't get the connection that the more you say weak, 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 the more you feel weak. Seven days in a week, the more you hear days, 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 the opposite of focus is days, dazed and confused. You don't think days as in days of the week, dazed and confused. You don't think and, you think they're separate. But the power of linguistics, the power of words is that there, I mean, the power is that there's actually power and people don't think that there's actually power. So that's one illumination that's fruitful for sure. So I guess this will be more of a gems than a check-in. The Most of these coach lives, coach lives have been check-ins, but I, this one is more gemmy. The power of words. Choose your words wisely. The pen is mightier than the sword. The tongue is mightier than whatever, the machine gun. <laughs> that's the gem for today. So as I enter into this space, uh, it made me remember that time is pretty much an illusion. I know that's impossible to come to terms with if you're just on normal time. But once you go deep into yourself, you'll realize that time is an illusion. There's only the present. It's just a real long, creative, magical present. And you can call it Monday on Mondays or Tuesday on Tuesdays, but I guarantee you it'll cycle back and However you look at it, from the perspective that you look at it, it will be present. So what then is time other than a measure to control the present? Not to say that it's not true, but it is also a true illusion. You are only present. The future never comes. It never comes. It integrates with the present. The past that we worry about so much, it just, it, it passed. Anywho, power of words. Use, use some stronger words today. Find a better way to say, instead of saying week, days of the week, say something, I'll figure something, be creative. That's all, find another way. I'll let this one be short because I gotta get back into the flow of school. I was in New York for the short, for the weekend, um, let's see, Saturday and Sunday. We came back yesterday, which is Monday. Today's Tuesday.
confused day. Try not to be dazed and confused in this powerful strength week. <laughs> Anywho, I think that's all I have for you. Um, I did. I realized I didn't provide any actual solutions. Like normally, when you're trying to give gems, you want to give something that has value that's convertible, right? So if I'm saying pay attention to the strength of language and I say weak, 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 weak. We need another word. And I haven't really provided another word, but I think it's more fruitful nowadays to just give you the tools to analyze. You don't need the answers. I don't have the answers. Yours are going to be different than mine. Feel me? Jeremy. All right, Coach Life signing off. Ciao.